structure. Exam is divided into two sessions, session one and session two. A 135 minute exam with 90 MCQ questions, multiple choice question in level one. Now, since it is divided into two parts, the topics are also divided into two parts. The first topic is ethics, QT, economics, and financial statements. The remaining six come in session two. Now, remember, this is a system-based exam now, computer of CBD assessment. So what gap do you need? You can decide on that between the two exams. Some are very comfortable writing together, so they take a 15, 20 minutes break and fix up the next day. So again, 135 minutes here, 135 minutes here. So, so at one go, we have to find the session one. Session one is one go. So which is two hours and approximately 15 minutes. So you have to sit and write the exam. Then before writing the second exam or session two, you can take a break. Break, you can decide how much time you need. You can take a break, but you have to fix it at the time of registration. What is the break that you require? And then you can again sit for the second level. So topics are divided, also divided into two parts. Uh, the ethics, the part one, ethics, QT, and four topics in the uh, first session, six topics in the second session. Now, those are also fixed. They are fixed. As per 2024 calendar, they can change going ahead in 25, but 24 we will be following the entire part. Now, important thing, please remember what I have seen students doing a lot of mistakes. I'll study only this and this, I'll get time. Does not happen that the exam is on the same day. We have to study everything together. Getting the idea? Don't keep in mind that normally when we are fresh, especially freshers, what we have is we have one exam on one day, one day before I'll study it, in the gap I'll study for the second. You don't get that time running. And the pressures are very heavy. One, it is a competitive exam. It's a system-based test. We prepare you for all those, uh, you know, mind things. But then you should also understand that you will not have a very fresh mind. Two hours and 15 minutes sitting for an exam takes a good amount of energy out of you. So plan this break will help you out in deciding how to plan a break, what to have, what not to have based on everyone has a different uh, look and feel on the exam. Some eat, some does not eat. So we will discuss that when we start up the program, we'll discuss how to, that's we call it as our planner. We'll discuss the entire planner together, how we plan. And effectively to make you sit for two and two hours and 15 minutes, our mock will happen in the same time that you have registered for your exam. So that you get into habit of sitting for those exams. We will not allow you to stand up and move. You have to sit and you have to sit. There is no other way out. You have to make your brain understand that I have to sit for this two hours and 15 minutes. Getting the idea? So, quoting here in the exam, two, two exams, 135 minutes each with 90 questions. So, approximately you have one, one minute and few uh, seconds running for each of one, 1. 1.3 approximately for every question. Any negative marking? No negative marking. There is no negative marking. 